Hello everyone, welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name's Gabby and we are going to be doing some back to school shopping. This is my favorite time of the summer because I'm so excited to go see my friends and meet my new teachers and everything. But I have to make sure I have all the right supplies to keep me going in this school year. So I'll see you at Walmart. Watch where you're going. <laughs> Watching. <laughs> Does your video show that you're about 20 feet away from this car? What car? Oh. I'm not. You guys always tell me, don't get too close to the cars. <laughs> Go. I go through the yellow sometimes and you guys were like, oh, it's red now. It's red now. I'm like, oh. Um, Whoops. No, that happened one time. She ran a red light. I did not run a red light. <laughs> this girl just be going through red it lights. It was yellow. You were really brave with that one. It was yellow the last time I looked at it. <laughs> the, the, the last time she looked at the light. Sorry, officer. Okay. So, I need notebooks. And pet. Oh. Oh, you just ran over me with the cart. That's so <laughs> mean. That's so rude. Okay, right, so I need I need like three or four notebooks. Mm. Or no, three. I need three notebooks. I think I'm gonna get this Paw Patrol backpack. Okay, so here's the pencils. I definitely need pencils because I'm like always losing and giving away all my pencils. So I think I'm gonna get these. I'm I'm gonna get seventy four. Five dollars. Five dollars for twenty seven. Yes I do. No, I need these ones. Why? Um, because they're better. They're aesthetically Yeah. And these ones are like aesthetic too, so that's good. And because I'm trying to be aesthetic this year, because I because I I learned and I need I need these ones. I need. I also need index cards. Okay. I need to find all the notebooks because I need I need three notebooks. So I need a spiral notebook and two composition notebooks. This, okay, they better not be tricking me because this has graph on it. Okay, if I pull this out and it's not graph, I'm actually gonna cry. Yes, okay, so this is graph, graph paper. That's fine because it's white. Look at this, look at this notebook. I need a composition notebook too, a regular one. None of these are very aesthetic, so I'm gonna try the other side. I'm aesthetic. You're not aesthetic, <laughs> what do you mean? Look at that, he's not aesthetic at all. I do need one of these though. It's a compass, because I'm doing geometry this year. I think I'm just gonna get this one. It's just black and white. Very simple. I think I'm gonna get that one. I have a ruler. I do need these though. Look, I'm gonna like beg my parents. Look, look at all of those colors. They're like, they would help me to take my notes, like, and make them look good so that it can help me study. I need lead. Look at all of this lead. This is a planner. I think this is really cute, actually. Oops, I grabbed two. Okay, so look at this. Look, it goes from July of 2023 to June of 2024, which is when I end school. I end school on June 16th. So this is a really nice planner. I think I might get this because I do want to be like super organized this year. I think that would really help me. Okay, yeah. so I'm on the hunt for folders now because I'm, get I'm getting two more folders. So I got a yellow one and a blue one have plastic colors and I have a purple one at home. So I think I'm good on school supplies. I would, and they got glue sticks. So I think I might steal a glue stick. Okay, so now we're back home, and I'm gonna show you guys everything that I got from Walmart for my school supplies. Let's get into opening my backpack. So we're gonna start at the bottom pocket right here. I feel like this kind of has the most stuff, I think. Just like little things. So when you open it, it looks like that. 
there's a bunch of pockets in here so in this front little pocket i was really not sure what i was gonna put in there because it's not very deep so i just put i put two of these pencil leads in there i put two pencil lead cases in there and then there's a second there's a second one right here but nothing really fit in there so i just moved on to the third one and so i have two black pens i have a blue and a, a dark blue and a purple pencil and I have a purple pink green and blue of the little aesthetic pens that I got and then in this one it's just like a singular little one and so I just put my sharpie in there because it just fits so perfectly back here I put my new graphing calculator still got to put the batteries in it and everything but I put that in this pocket back here um, in the same pocket, I have this like 35 pack of gum, um, because I love gum. I feel like it just kind of gets me through. It just gives me a little something to do while I'm doing an assignment or working on a project. And I think that it just kind of gets my brain going and making sure that I'm like doing something while I'm like writing just to keep me focused. And I think that that's really nice. In this pocket, I have my index cards. Um, I just shoved as many, I just shoved the whole packet in there, but I think I'm not gonna take the whole packet on my first day of school. I'll probably take like half, um, cause I don't think I'll need all of them, but I do think that it would be really good to take notes on um, and anything that I need for that. So that was my first pocket. Now my second pocket, it's quite a bit bigger um so in this pocket i have all my folders are back here i have a purple a blue and a yellow folder and then i have two books that i got from the library because i love reading i just started reading a bit um and then i kind of took a break for a little bit because i couldn't really find any books that i liked but then i got into these books look pretty good so I'm in the middle of reading to all the boys I loved before and then I got this book it's called all the bright places and I haven't started reading that yet so it was recommended by one of my friends and then next to my book over here I have my pencil case and I'll show you what's in there at the end one more thing that I have in my second pocket is my planner that I almost forgot to show you guys I ended up getting this planner, it's green and blue. Very excited to use this. Okay, we had a little accident. Trey, what happened to your finger? I just threw out the garbage on my finger. He was helping my dad throw out the garbage and he closed the garbage on his finger. So he came over to help me finish my video and gave me a big hug. And I think he's okay now. But I'm gonna show you guys everything that's in my pencil case. It's mostly just like backups for everything that I had in my first pocket, but I'm going to show you guys everything that's in here. I actually got this pencil case last Christmas. Oh, hello. This is my little sister. <laughs> so I got this last Christmas and was using it all of last year. It, I think some ink spilled on it or something. It has this like blue stain on it, but that's all right. It's not my, it doesn't have to be anything special. Okay. Actually, this is the first pocket up here. I know. It's broken. No, it's not. Okay, so this is the first pocket right here. And so I flipped this part. <laughs> Hang on. Whoops, thank you. So I flipped this part down, and this these are all of my erasable pens. So I have a purple, blue, red, green, and orange of my erasable pens right here. I used those all of last year. Um, but I really like the pens that I got this year. I basically just have a few pens, pencils, and I have my compass in here. And so I also have two of those big erasers that I got. I have those in here. And then I have this gargoyle eraser. I got that last year on Halloween, actually, and used it like all of last year. Just for little things. But Okay, so first I have this pencil with the same color eraser top on it for the the ones with the eraser tops are for people to borrow because I don't want them to use my eraser because I already use my eraser too much so I want them to use this one 
Okay, and so I have my compass right here. Um, it's just going to go in my pencil case because I don't think I'm going to be needing it every day, so it doesn't need to be too accessible. <laughs> okay, so I have these Sharpie highlighters. So I have purple. Let's see. I have purple, orange, I have a light pink, I have a hot pink, and I have a blue, and I have a green one. Like all of these Sharpie highlighters to make my stuff so aesthetic. They're kind of pastel colors. Most of them are. And the rest of these aesthetic pens that I got, um, I thought that they were so cute. I'm so glad that my mom let me get them. So we're just going to put all of these pens in here. And then I have this orange pen with an orange eraser for people to use. And this pink pencil with a pink eraser for people to use. I also have this extra, this backup extra, um, black pen. And then one of my friends, Anna, she's actually going to be a senior this year, which is crazy. But she gave me this. She told her that I loved this pen, the color, because she had me sign her yearbook. I could pick any color from all of her pens. And so I signed it with this, and I was like, oh my gosh, I love that color. And she was like, oh, you can keep it. I was like, oh my gosh, thank you so much. So I got to keep this pen, so I'm definitely keeping this in my pencil case. So in my third pocket, in this sleeve back here you open the velcro and then i have my computer my computer that i got from the school and then i have my binder this one is for orchestra for all my orchestra music and for my old binder i have page protectors for all of my music that i get so i'm definitely gonna put my page protectors into this binder next i got this um spiral notebook it's a five star notebook and i really like five star it's college ruled and i think that it's really nice it it has like a little pocket in here that you can put loose some loose papers and then it has a same pocket on this side of the page too next i have this it's a graphing notebook look it's like graph it's good for because i'm taking geometry this year so that's going to be good for my geometry class the last notebook that I got is this. It's also a five-star notebook, but it's a composition notebook. So this one will be good for my English class. I was talking to some of my older friends, and they have the same teacher that I'm getting for my English class. So, And they said that you need a composition notebook. So I got this composition notebook for my English class. So that's it from the three big pockets. On this side, I just put some sticky notes. I think that... If you want to take like longer written notes or if you, if you have time you can make your notes look a little more aesthetic then you use your index cards but just like quick little things I would use these sticky notes and I saw so I have three colors I have pink orange and this like neon green they're all pretty neon colors and I like that and I just put this in this little side pocket it has this little opening because it's supposed to be for tissues but I haven't gotten tissues yet, and I don't know if I really will, because I don't, um, I don't know. I, my allergies get kind of weird, but I think that it, this is a better place for what, this side pocket. Or I might put an umbrella in there for when I start driving, because the sophomores, when they start driving, they have to park like a mile away from the school. They can't park in the parking lot, because our parking lot is too small. So I think that I might just put an umbrella in there when I start driving. Now on this side, right now I just have my glasses. I'll probably not keep those in there. Um, I just don't want them to get stolen or anything. I might put them in my sec in the second pocket or my first pocket, whichever one has more room. But um, yes, and I'll just put my water bottle in there instead. This side, um, so on the back of it, it's kind of hidden as like padding, but I still haven't taken the tag off. I need to do that. But it it's kind of looks like padding, but it's like an anti-theft pocket. So like when you're just walking around, whether you're walking down, around in an airport or at school, people don't like try to open your bag and take stuff. So I'll probably just put my phone in there during passing time just or hold my phone just to make sure. Or while I'm in class also, just to make sure that nobody takes anything that I want. If I'm traveling, I might put my passport or my ID in there or, you know, other things like that. 
Okay guys, thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed, make sure to give it a big thumbs up and don't forget to smash that subscribe button and make sure to turn on my post notifications because I'm actually going to start posting a lot more. So make, make sure you stay tuned for all the rest of my back to school videos and everything coming forward. Thank you. I love you guys so much. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.